Kimberly O'Brien. Imagine, it's 2 p.m. in the afternoon, on a work day. How are you feeling? Are you energized and excited about your work? Or are you feeling tired and exhausted, clutching on to that last cup of coffee, or so you tell yourself, just counting the hours until you go, can go home? Well, you don't need to feel that way. And as a naturopathic doctor, I help you to get your energy back and to feel fabulous. Fatigue is so common, but it truly holds us back from living a happy and fulfilling life. We need energy to do the things that we love. And one of my patients, Angela, truly found this out firsthand after struggling with fatigue and depression over the past few years. As a professional woman, she is pouring all of her reserves into her job and was out of gas by the time she got home to spend time with her family. On top of this, she was also experiencing troubling digestive symptoms and despite medical testing, had not come up with an answer. Angela was feeling alone and without direction was really starting to feel hopeless. How could she take action to improve her health when she didn't even know what was wrong? Now, some of you here may resonate with Angela, and it was through that experience that she came to me in search of answers. As a naturopathic doctor, I find that there are typically one or two causes that unite all of your seemingly unrelated symptoms, and that when I identify and treat those causes, that we can achieve long-lasting and rapid transformations in your health. As a society, we've become so accustomed to treating our symptoms, taking antacids, sleeping aids, and painkillers to suppress our symptoms instead of truly identifying what's at the root cause. Now, this is like mopping up water from a leak without actually addressing the leak itself. We wouldn't do that, right? Now, when you see me in my practice, I'm going to assess various aspects of your health in order to find the underlying cause of your own symptoms. And one of the main areas that I will be looking at is your diet. Now, you don't need to worry. I'm not only looking at your cupcake to cauliflower ratio, which might have some of you a little bit nervous. And in fact, what I'm really trying to assess is whether there is one or two specific foods or food groups that are leading to your symptoms. Now, these type of reactions are called food sensitivities, and they're very different from food allergies, which you may be more familiar with. Think of something like a peanut allergy. Now, with food allergies, the symptoms that people experience are severe, and they experience them immediately after they've eaten that food. So this makes identifying the symptom to the food as the cause very simple. Food sensitivities are different, and people often don't experience the symptoms of food sensitivities until up to 72 hours after they've eaten that food. Due to this delay in the reaction and the nature of the symptoms that are experienced, most people have no idea that food may be at the underlying cause of their symptoms. Symptoms that can be caused by food sensitivities include chronic things you may be experiencing on an everyday basis. Things like fatigue, digestive upset, bloating or IBS, uh, skin concerns like acne or eczema, anxiety, depression, joint pain, headaches, a number of things that you may not expect. Now, with Angela, what I identified was that she had a food sensitivity to dairy and to wheat. And after only two weeks of avoiding these foods, she had a dramatic transformation in her mood and her energy levels, and a complete resolution in her digestive symptoms, which is pretty amazing. Now, do you know whether the foods in your diet are fueling or fooling your health? You do not need piles of medications, or supplements for that matter, in order to transform your health. But what you do need to do is to identify and address the underlying cause of your symptoms. And identifying your food sensitivities is a very important place to start. Imagine if only two weeks from now, you're feeling like a new, revitalized, and energetic you. I encourage you to get my contact information from the table at the back so that I can guide you there. Thank you. <laughs>